Hey friends, welcome back to East Texas Kitchen. I'm Mama Steph, and I'm here with my favorite chef. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One of my favorites. I have so many wonderful chefs Your here. Loves. But, <laughs> but Simon Webster from Palestine's beautiful Sephora Passion. And um, in your restaurant, if you're staying on campus, on site there, what is your restaurant called? So, uh, well, Restaurant Aubergine. Aubergine. And it's for people who are staying at And, and people coming from the outside site. as well, as long as we've got availability. You have to have reservations yeah. and available. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. So um, I just thought I would throw that out there. So what are we making today? Hey, it's getting nice wet and nice weather sometimes. It's, it's like <laughs> it's, it's a bananas foster, but oh. it has um, meringue on the top. So it's kind of like a banana foster baked Alaska deal without Man, the sponge. You are so creative. So all we're going to do is make some sauce in the bottom, recipes on the website. Okay. You're going to put your bananas in there. Okay, so it's like a brown sugar. Yeah, sauce. it's a brown sugar. Um, obviously, a little bit of alcohol in there because you mm -hmm. know it's Texas. Of course, of course. <laughs> um, bring it to the boil, but not, make sure you use not too ripe bananas. Otherwise, it will go very mushy on you. Oh, okay. So Good then, chef. all you do is you just drink. cook it for a few seconds in there. Okay. And then pour it into whatever you want to make it. I like the ones with the handles, so I use mugs quite a lot. It's a good idea for a dessert like yeah. this that has layers. Beautiful. So, so how long do you want to cook those bananas? Just in? make your sauce, and if your make sauce is first. warm, just put your bananas in and there. And let them just yeah. slightly get warm. Yeah. Okay. So you've got them in your, in your little cup. Okay. Then you're going to put some ice cream on top. Now okay. I have some homemade um, hokey pokey ice cream, which is New Zealand ice cream. Yes. Vanilla. I have had this before. Before. With pieces of caramel in it. Oh, it's so good, y'all. And then you just put into the mold there like that. So okay. once you've done that, okay. you whip up some egg whites. Okay. Again, it's all in the recipe. It's all in the recipe you. online. You can pipe this on the top if you want. Oh, look how beautiful it is. That looks like fun. Or you can just spoon it on, but make lots of little spiky bits on it, because then you've got to use one of these. Oh, how fun. And fun, fun, just fun. carefully go around. <laughs> I love that. And if it's got a handle on it, it makes it easier to turn. Keep the kids away from this part. <laughs> no children involved in this part, please. Everything else they could help with, though. You could. You could dust it with powdered sugar. Oh, they could do that part. There you so go. So that makes it so beautiful, as you can see in front of us. And... Um, that so how would you um, kind of break into that like with a long handled teaspoon? A long handled and, teaspoon is best. Okay. Yeah, and it then, works really well. So. And is there because it's so beautiful and, and but it seems like it's customizable. Is there another thing? Okay, you could so put you in could use sauce? wild berries, so when the berries are out, use wild berries in there. You oh, could change yeah. the ice cream to something else. If you like chocolate, put chocolate chips in there and, uh -huh. and ice cream. Oh, um, yeah. you can make it kind of the day before mm -hmm. just with the syrup and the bananas. And then when you want to serve, just put your ice cream on there mm -hmm. and then pipe your meringue on the that top. That is perfect. That's just so beautifully done. You are always one of the best Cheers. ones for just your creativity. I admire it so much. And so if you want to try this at home, make sure you check out the East Texas Kitchen app right now. We have it there for you. And um, I'll put a link to Simon's Place as well. Thanks so much, Simon. We appreciate Thank you. you coming. Appreciate it.